So finally, using the full axis on a job, so I thought I'd just show you, real short video. We've got a requirement from a customer for a project that we're doing a lot of work on, and we need to make some really tight radius bends out of aluminium for a bit of framework that you cannot buy. And speaking to a lot of people, um, emailed a few companies, you cannot do such a tight bend radius either because it is ridiculously tight. So we're gonna machine, fourth axis machine, a billet bend with spigots on each end that will go inside the tube and allow us to do the design of the framework that the customers asked for. So we started off with a block, stood it on its end like that in the vise, and we machined that spigot on it. Now this only has to be four or five mil long, but it's 50 mil long so that we can have 30 mil, um, 35 mil in the collet so it's nice and solid and have 20 20 something mil 25 mil stick out there because we have to get tall in the back here and go around so yeah we're going to machine the billet piece on there and i'll show you what it's like when it's finished we go there's the finished part surface finish would probably be a bit better if we used coolant but I was only using the air blast there to try and get a bit better footage for the camera so you can see there's a bit of rubbish there from the tool but yeah so there's the finished part here's one of the others that we done you see it's got a slightly better surface finish because we use coolant on this one so these are tight radius bends, 20 mil OD that we couldn't buy for a project. And we're gonna uh, slide this spigot section inside the tube. This will be cut down, it's only long to hold on to, as said before. And then this section will go inside the tube and they'll be welded. Finish isn't critical because it's gonna be blasted and then painted or powder coated, I do believe. So yeah, part on the fourth axis. Short video. Cheers for watching.